and welcome back to Station Road. My name is Julian. Just when I thought a three-part intro would be enough to cover all the bases for Station Road, I've decided that I needed a part four. So what better way than to take a closer look at Station Road and the full layout than to take a cab ride. And what better locomotive to take a cab ride in than the Class 20. So there's two reasons um, I've chosen this locomotive. Firstly, this is actually one of my favourite locomotives from um, Barkman. Uh, the fact that it's factory weathered has meant I haven't had to weather it um, and run the risk of wrecking it. And it is also uh, got an interesting sound. Uh, well, the, the real live uh, Class 20s ha do have an un unusual sound. So, um, so you, you will see and, um, this when, uh, when we take our cab ride. So uh, as, as we travel around the layout, you'll see that it's very incomplete in most locations. And, uh, and this is uh, work yet to still be done. But this is certainly a, um, a thorough way of looking at uh, the station road layout. So without further ado, let's hop on board.
So I hope you enjoyed that uh, trip around my layout and fortunately um, I was a bit worried that, uh, that we might spot a few creepy crawlies uh, inside the tunnels but fortunately uh, it seemed actually pretty clear. There's uh, also probably some other um, unusual glitches in the matrix as well that you may have spotted. So you're probably wondering how did I put this video together and it's actually quite simple. So we had our class 20 and uh, we saw that at the beginning and um, the idea was to um, uh, to admire it from a from a train spotter's point of view I guess um, but uh, our cab was actually a Polaroid cube so this was actually um, mentioned by Charlie from Chadwick Model Railway and he has used uh, this uh, uh, Polaroid cube to do some footage actually I think he, I believe he did some at an exhibition but um, I thought that is an excellent idea so I thought how hard can it be to go out and buy one well it proved to be actually near impossible because uh, I, I from what I understand it's no longer in production or if it is it's certainly not available in New Zealand uh, so um, I ended up finding this on Facebook Marketplace so and and for a very very reasonable price I believe um, in working order so um, the great uh, thing about this camera is um, it has a magnet on it so um, just using a, a flat deck wagon and this is a, a Daypole uh, flat flat wagon and it just simply because the wagon has got a, a metal weight inside um, inserted inside it the camera magnetizes itself to the wagon so um, just popping that on there and then pop that on onto um, the front of your locomotive and simply push it around the track it has Wi-Fi in it so uh, I think um, I haven't tried it but I believe that you can actually uh, uh, live record via your phone or a uh, laptop or any Wi-Fi device and um, it has USB and a micro SD so you can download the videos afterwards yeah it um, it's a great little purchase and so um, the plan is uh, of course that I will do some uh, cab rides at various points and that will um, show you the progress of the layout um, some points it may be very slow <laughs> so um thank you for watching and uh and i hope you enjoyed today's cab ride and don't forget to subscribe uh that's so important please subscribe and uh click the bell and you'll uh, that'll enable you to get notifications of my um upcoming videos so take care everyone and i will see you in my next video